three quarters of fame, and we are outside Magnolia Thunder Pussy oh. to check out some amazing records. <laughs> <laughs> I love this record because it's just blank. <laughs> it's just white. The songs are great. Oh, they're no, great. Gorillas. Gorillas. It's an absolute yeah. album. <laughs> Listen to this on repeat. California. What is this? Sam, it's gonna get Yo. every single uh, one in this store. Betty Self Rising Southern Blends. <laughs> Sounds like a nice like restaurant dish. <laughs> My humble opinion. I know it's very generic. It's the best album I ever. Humble pie. Oh you want to find the? Okay, let's try to find the weirdest name. The weirdest name. <laughs> it's gonna take. Duran Duran. I feel bad for Duran, whoever Duran. I choose. And like you have the weirdest band name. Joshua Tree album because uh, this just got me into music in the first place. Just love absolutely everything about it. It's so unique. You can listen to it on repeat. And it's just beautiful. It's a beautiful album. Love it. Check it out. Now I picked this because I was given this as a present on a DVD when I was like 10. And it inspired me to like form the first little band I was in, which was like some cover band when I was like 10 years old. And it's Red Hot Chili Peppers Greatest Hits. It's got like all the big songs on there. Well, there's probably too many. They're not all the big songs, but you know what I mean. But yeah, this, I remember this, like just looking at this every day and watching it. Had music videos with it as well. Give it away music video. You've seen that? Give it away. It's crazy. I've met one person who doesn't like Queen, and if they do, then they're not my friend. They don't like Queen. But um, I don't know, the reason why I've chosen this one is because like when I was younger, the first thing I got into was like musical theatre and my teacher at the time wrote like rewrote one of the songs it was like We Will Rock You and um, another one Blast the Dust but it was based on like King Tut and Carmen and Henry Carter and I had to dress up as both of them and do like this weird parody sort of thing I think I was like 11 or 12 but it's great memories and just great music love Queen love Freddie Mercury it's amazing